Hey guys, Kyle Vosberg with Master's Choice. I thought we'd spend a little bit of time today talking about leaf disease and fungicide application in your corn silage. Now is the first week of July. It is the perfect time to get out and start walking your fields, uh, taking a look, spending some time scouting for leaf disease, whether that be northern corn leaf blight, gray leaf spot, um, or a specific uh, rust that might be coming into your area. I know that we're getting close to pollinations, but it's around the time when leaf disease seems to be taking its hold on a lot of corn hybrids. And so right now is the time to be looking, understanding um, what your fields, how your hybrids are reacting to some of those leaf diseases, and what's your plan of attack. Uh, one little piece of knowledge that I would give is if your corn hybrid is in tassel and, and into silk, uh, moving into the step of pollination, I would lean away from fungicide application until that is over. Most fungicides are oil-based and that can actually prohibit uh, pro proper pollination. So at that time, I would at least give it a little bit, uh, allow it to get itself through pollination, and then work out your plan for a fungicide application. We have seen time and time again that fungicide application has helped with overall corn silage quality at harvest. So if it's something that's going to be part of your program, now's the time to scout, get out, and make a decision. 